The CAN Converter is an award-winning UL classified product that allows easy, affordable transformation from an ordinary CAN light to a variety of lighting design choices. This presentation will provide you with step-by-step -step instructions for installing the R4 CAN Converter in conjunction with a chandelier. Before you begin, you will need to have a few tools on hand. Make sure you have a power drill, a slotted screwdriver, a Phillips screwdriver, a marker, wire cutters, and safety goggles. To get started, lay out the contents of the CAN converter box. Your box will contain a power outlet adapter with power leads, a mounting bracket assembly, the bracket shoe, the mounting bar and mounting screws, two self-tapping sheet metal screws, and a wrench. Before we start the installation, Turn on the light switch to the can you will be replacing. In your breaker box, make sure you shut off the power to that switch. On your existing can light, remove the light bulb and the can trim. Within your existing can housing, there may be a metal bracket that holds the light socket. If it is adjustable, loosen the wing nut and slide the bracket to the top of the can housing. Then tighten the wing nut and screw in the CAN converter power outlet adapter. If your socket is not adjustable or there is no metal bracket, just remove the socket from the trim. Then screw the CAN converter power adapter into the socket. If your socket is attached to the top of the CAN, just screw the CAN converter power adapter into the socket. Remove the mounting bar and save the screws. Set the mounting bracket assembly in the can. If the mounting bracket hits against a metal screw in the can, remove that metal screw. Using the wrench in your can converter kit, expand the bracket shoes so that the mounting bracket fits snugly inside the wall of the can housing. There are two holes on opposite sides of the mounting bracket. Using the self-tapping sheet metal screws, screw all the way into the can housing. Pull the wires from the power outlet adapter down to the base of the can. At this point, you may want to assemble your new lighting fixture. Determine the length of the chain you will need by measuring how far from the ceiling the fixture will drop. Cut the chain to length. Place the mounting bar against the light canopy and screw the fixture's threaded pipe up through the mounting bar until the edge of the threaded pipe rests one quarter inch below the light canopy. Screw on the nut that will secure the threaded pipe to the mounting bar. Screw the light hook onto the threaded pipe. Thread the chandelier wires through the chain. Run the chandelier nut and the chandelier canopy onto the chain. Thread the wires through the pipe and attach the chain to the light hook. Bring your pre-assembled chandelier into position. If the chandelier is awkward, you may want to place it on a box just high enough so that the end of the chain will reach the can light housing. Pull the wires down from the top of the pipe to rest below the mounting bar. Use the small screws to attach the mounting bar to the mounting bracket assembly. Then cut the wires to length. Using wire nuts, Pair together the fixture's hot wire and the power outlet adapter's hot wire, the subsequent neutral wires, and the ground wires. Tuck the wiring into the canopy of your new lighting fixture. Screw the large nut to the light hook to secure the canopy to the ceiling. Turn the power back on at your breaker box and enjoy your new lighting fixture. <laughs>